Hello, in this episode of Megabox Mondays, I'm going to have a look at a filament from Philo Alpha. It's called Alpha Sync Green Tafea. Tafeta? Tafeta? Uh, it's a PLA uh, like filament. Right, let's have a look at the intro. So, here on the label, they say. Uh, print temperature should be 210 to 230, so a little bit hotter than normal PLA, and I was printing at 215. Uh, bed temperature room to 70, and speed not listed, and fan, yes, and um, other information is print like PLA. If using PA, put some glue stick on it, and I was using the PA sheet on my Prusa printers with a little bit of magic glue, and had no problems with... Uh, Sticking to the bed, but here they say Philo Alpha Alpha Sync is a easy to print material suitable for any type of 3D printer. The glossy finish is enriched by a pleasant reflection, very similar to, to that of silk from which it takes its name. The already excellent mechanical resistance and a low retraction is enriched by a greater impact resistance and electricity. Tisticity, uh, I can't say that word, <laughs> uh, that makes uh, it a highly performing material for various applications. Uh, Philo Alpha Alpha Sync completely non toxic and odorless until high temperature will amaze for a high adhesion between layers if printed at higher temperatures. And you can get more information at philoalpha3d.com and it's made in Italy. Uh, so let's have a look at the prints. So the first print I did was this Benchy and it came up absolutely amazing. It's a really nice Benchy, no problem. Uh, it's showing up on the camera a little bit lighter than it actually is, but it's like a bright green color and the surface finish is excellent and the shine of the filament is really nice. You can see how it reflects. Uh, so this came out pretty much perfect. I then printed out my maker coin. Um, that also came out really good. Really shiny print and, and really nice looking. Uh, so I'm really happy with that. Um, then I printed Sir layers a lot and that as well came out excellent. Absolutely no issues, no drooping or stringing or any kind of print errors. Just absolutely perfect print. <laughs> and finally I printed the artist model by Gareth. And this came out excellent as well. Here I just ran out of filament. <laughs> but the, the back side here is looking really nice. No stringing in between the, the fangs here and, or the hair part. <laughs> and it's looking extremely nice. So I was really happy with this filament. So overall, I was, like I said, really happy with this filament. It uh, came out excellent, very easy to print, and uh, no stringing issues, even though I printed a little bit hotter than normal PLA, maybe. Um, absolutely just cool filament. It shows on camera, on the closer camera, a little bit lighter green. It's uh, like really bright green color, um, really nice. So I was really happy with this filament and if you get a chance to buy this filament I would highly recommend it. But this will be it for this video. I hope you like what I'm doing here on the channel and if you do subscribe and give me a comment on what you think of it and, and a like. But for now I thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.